It is crucial viewing, but it's not easy to watch. India's daughter investigates the gang rape, torture, and murder of 23-year-old Jyoti Singh in Delhi in 2012. Leslie Udwin's documentary confronts the misogyny ingrained, almost enshrined, in India's culture. To witness Jyoti's grieving parents is heartbreaking. And it's enraging to hear her rapist killers justify the attack. India's daughter exposes systemic sexual violence while also demanding change. On 16 December 2012, a 23-year-old medical student was on her way home from a movie with a male friend. The couple boarded a private bus. She was dragged to the back, where she was gang-raped by six men as the bus drove round and round the highways. A woman is raped in India every 20 minutes. This rape led to unprecedented protests erupting across India. The silence has been broken. Here to accept the Peabody Award is Leslie Udwin. a Peabody Award for my first documentary and my debut as a director. <laughs> Thank you. It's the most fortifying affirmation of the journey making this film, which was both challenging and extremely shocking. I would like to, um, from the heart, say how honored I am and how grateful I am. Thank you, Peabody, and happy birthday. Um, it's important to note that this film is not just about the total devastating disregard for women and girls in India. It is about the violation of the human rights of women and girls across the world. And here too, in this country that I love, where one in four girls on college campuses is raped, where the Equal Rights Amendment is still not ratified. Profound thanks are due to the public broadcasters, where would we be without them, BBC and PBS, to ITVS and Independent Lens, and to indomitable supporters and committed executive producers, Lois Vossen, Nick Fraser, Meda Hoffman, Jana Shea from Seaview Productions, Lorna Auerbach from Chaska Films, Susan Sarandon, Thomas Morgan, Kathleen Glynn and Leslie Decker, and I've remembered them all. A huge thank you also to our supporters, Meryl Streep, Sean Penn, Emma Thompson, Helen Mirren, extraordinary people who care uh, deeply about women and girls. I am well over time, but I'm gonna risk being dragged kicking and screaming from here because this is really important. When you lay bare a problem with such blinding clarity as we do in India's Daughter. What happens is that the solution looms with equal searing clarity. The solution is an initiative called Think Equal, which is determined to bring a new subject onto the compulsory curricula of schools from the early years to educate children's hearts and not just their heads, to teach them to love and not just to hate and discriminate. Please visit thinkequal.com. Resolve to support us. I'm advising the UN Human Rights Office on this and I'm committing the rest of my life to it. Please join hands with us to create a safe, a free and an equal world. Thank you.